Beneath the surface of our world lies a vast, mysterious realm. Covering over 70% of the Earth's surface, the ocean is not simply a body of water, it is a universe in its own right. Deeper, older, and more diverse than any ecosystem on land, the ocean hides life forms beyond imagination, many of which we have yet to discover. Despite its sheer scale and importance, more than 80% of the world's oceans remain unexplored. We know more about the surface of the moon than we do about our own ocean floor. And within these depths, life thrives in strange, beautiful, and sometimes terrifying forms. Fish, in particular, represent one of the most incredible expressions of marine diversity. Scientists have identified over 33,000 species of fish to date, but experts believe the real number is far higher, perhaps as many as 50,000 or more. They exist in every corner of the ocean, from shallow coral reefs to the crushing blackness of the abyss. Fish come in all shapes and sizes, from the tiniest dwarf goby to the massive whale shark, the largest known fish on Earth. Their bodies have evolved for speed, stealth, camouflage, and even flight. Some glow in the dark, others vanish in plain sight, and a few, like the goblin shark, seem to belong to another planet altogether. In the sunlit upper layers of the ocean, we find colorful reef dwellers like the clownfish, angelfish, and parrotfish, species that form intricate communities around coral reefs. These fish feed on algae, plankton, or small invertebrates, maintaining the delicate balance of these underwater cities. In contrast, deeper waters host predators like the lanternfish, which use bioluminescence to attract prey in the pitch black at even greater depths, past 1,000 meters where light cannot reach, live creatures so alien that early explorers mistook them for monsters. Here swim the fangtooth, the barrel eye fish, with a transparent head, and the terrifying anglerfish, with its dangling, glowing lure. But fish are only part of the story. The ocean is home to over 230,000 known species of marine life, and that number is likely a fraction of what truly exists. There are sea turtles that migrate thousands of miles between feeding and nesting grounds, giant squid that roam the deep in near total secrecy, coral polyps no bigger than grains of rice that collectively build entire reef systems visible from space. There are marine mammals like dolphins and whales, capable of complex communication and social bonding. There are microscopic phytoplankton that, despite their size, produce most of the oxygen we breathe. Some of the most remarkable ecosystems are found in places few humans have ever seen. Around hydrothermal vents, fissures in the seafloor where hot, mineral-rich water spews out, entire communities thrive in total darkness. These organisms depend not on sunlight, but on chemosynthesis, extracting energy from chemical reactions. Tube worms with no mouths or digestive tracts grow meters long, feeding off bacteria inside their bodies. Crabs with fur-like structures graze on microbial mats. These deep-sea ecosystems are so unique, they are considered analogs for how life might exist on other planets, such as the icy moons of Jupiter and Saturn. Despite this richness, the ocean faces extraordinary threats. Overfishing has decimated fish populations around the globe. With more than 90% of large species like tuna, marlin, and swordfish now gone from many waters. Coral reefs, home to 25% of all marine life, are dying due to ocean acidification and warming temperatures. Plastic pollution has choked marine environments, with an estimated 11 million tons of plastic entering the ocean every year. Microplastics now contaminate not just water and fish, but also the bodies of humans who depend on seafood. Even more alarming is the damage being done in the deep sea. As surface resources dwindle, mining companies are beginning to target the ocean floor for precious metals used in electronics. This involves dredging or drilling through fragile, ancient habitats that took millions of years to form, habitats we do not yet fully understand and likely never will if they are destroyed. Yet, amid these challenges, the ocean also offers hope. Marine protected areas, zones where human activity is restricted, have shown dramatic success in restoring fish populations and reef health. In places like the Great Barrier Reef and the Pacific Remote Islands, 
conservation has led to the return of apex predators, the revival of coral species, and the rebirth of marine diversity. The resilience of the ocean, when given space and time to heal, is nothing short of extraordinary. The ocean is not only a source of wonder, it is vital to our survival. It regulates our climate by absorbing heat and carbon dioxide. It produces more than half the oxygen in our atmosphere through phytoplankton photosynthesis. It sustains entire industries and livelihoods, from fishing to tourism. For over 3 billion people, fish and other seafood are a primary source of protein. What is often forgotten is that many marine animals are far more intelligent and sentient than we once believed. Fish can recognize individual human faces. Some species, like groupers and wrasses, cooperate with other species to hunt. Others can use tools, form social hierarchies, and display behaviors we once thought exclusive to mammals and birds. Dolphins pass down knowledge from one generation to the next. Octopuses can solve puzzles and escape from locked tanks. The ocean is not just a wilderness, it is a community of thinking, reacting, and feeling life. Still, we remain detached from it. Most people will never dive deep into the ocean. They will never swim beside a whale or hear the songs of dolphins echoing through the waves. But even from a distance, our actions have consequences. Every choice, from the seafood we eat to the plastic we discard, ripples through the water in ways we cannot always see. And yet, the mystery remains. With over 80% of the ocean unexplored, the greatest secrets of our planet still lie beneath the waves. We've only mapped a fraction of the sea floor. We continue to discover new species with every deep sea expedition. We still don't fully understand how massive currents work, how deep sea creatures communicate, or whether ancient ruins lie buried in the continental shelves. The ocean holds answers to questions we haven't even asked yet. To understand the ocean is to understand life itself, not just its beauty, but its complexity, its vulnerability, and its endurance. It is a world of extremes, pressure that can crush steel, creatures that glow in the dark, and silence so deep it humbles the soul. It is ancient, it is alive, and it is at risk. What lies beneath the waves is more than a mystery. It is a mirror, reflecting the health of our planet, the legacy of our actions, and the future we choose to build. If we lose the ocean, we lose everything. But if we protect it, we preserve not only its wonders, but our own place within them. If this journey into the deep ocean moves you, if it opened your eyes to the beauty, mystery, and fragility of the world beneath the waves, then don't let it stop here. Subscribe for more stories about the hidden worlds most people never see, from the darkest trenches to the brightest coral reefs. Like this video to show your support for marine life and the people fighting to protect it. Because the sea is not silent. It's calling us to learn, to protect, and to remember that our future is tied to its survival. Dive deeper. Stay curious. The ocean is just getting started.